the Budweiser's back. So I wanted to show you um, the results. This is a water hash. This is a 73 mic micron water hash in a turkey bag that we're going to roll. So we will be pressing this and I wanted to introduce Mike. He's with Bees Knees Nectar. He's going to show you how to roll this and press this and, and, uh, and then we're also going to show you um, CO2 keef making, which is a very easy way to produce a hash for your home use. Hello, my name is Mike. I am from Bees Knees Nectar. And in this process, what we're going to do is create the next step in the hash making process. So what you'll need to do is get a bottle, fill it with hot boiling water to the top, close it off, definitely get some gloves because it's going to be hot to press, press and roll with. So in the next process, what we're going to do is we're going to go down to this hash and start rolling the hash over. And what this is going to do, it's going to create a whole mass of resin inside of this turkey bag. And what this is going to create as a decarboxylation process to help the mass become one big resin and create it into a THC instead of a THCA by removing the Ku molecule. And what this will do will help get through the blood brain barrier a lot faster and create a longer lasting high for yourself. So right now we are continuing with the pressing of the hash. And what this will do is create the resins to break up your method of doing this is kind of like kneading flour, uh, basically dough when it's real thick you knead it so it's a flat piece and once it's a flat piece you'll take it out and fold it back up and knead it again and you want to create this process and repeat it about three to four times depending on the resins. So in this next process here we have taken the flat piece of hash, like I said it would become one flat piece. Your next process is to continue pressing it by rolling it up into a big little square or some kind of thicker hash patty. And what you will do is you'll put it back into the bag and create the second pressing of the resins.